All right, all right, all right. We're here on Multiverses Season 2. Welcome or welcome back to McFly, the place where I just sit around and play a lot of random video games. Ready to check out Season 2 of Multiverses 2? Well, not Multiverses, I guess the re-release, not 2. But today is update day, and it's Season 2. I had a lot of gripes with Season 1. I'm hoping Season 2 will iron out a lot of that. And then we also have things to look into. We have Samurai Jack they teased, Beetlejuice, Ranked Mode, a whole bunch of stuff. So let's check it out and see if there's anything good. Hopefully some new freebies. Check out the new Battle Pass. Just trying to look for the positive, you know? Don't you touch me, you two-bit tramp! Oh! Ranked is open for business. Now you can unlock Ranked Mode at level 5 and participate in special matches to test your metal. Prove your might. And get your name in the spotlight throughout the multiverse. Multiversal games. New to Season 2, get a special boost when wearing specific variants. During the Multiversal Games event, when wearing variant with sports attire tag, get a 50% boost to all events, battle pass XP, and character XP. Account XP per match. Alright, there's good incentive, I like that. Well, I guess, okay, they're adding more outfits. We'll have to check them out. At least people are getting more outfits, because that's what I was thinking about. I don't want to just play LeBron. <laughs> or LeBron and Jason. Who else am I forgetting? I can't think of it, but that's good. They're adding actual outfits. Look at Marvin's right there with the golf. I love that. Then we have Path of the Samurai. Embark on an epic journey with Samurai Jack in our latest Battle Pass season. Oh, no, he's first. Okay, good. You just got to buy the Battle Pass. I'm glad I'm wrong. <laughs> All right, and then the start of season two. Look at it. Yeah, they got a new Rifts tab. That's cool. Yeah, there's ranked 1v1 ranked. That's cool. I like that. 2v2s. Go to ranked event. Bronze, silver, gold. I love that it's toast and like breakfast related. That's so awesome. And badges awarded upon achievement for its respective game mode. Variants and banners awarded at the end of season based on peak rank. Okay, so you get different style of skins for your character. That's pretty cool. It's kind of like shaders, but I like that. It's cool. It gives incentive. That's what we want. Cool. What else we got here? We got fighters. Can you just purchase Agent Smith now? Yeah, you can just... 600? Or 6,000? I mean, he is new. I expected it to be more expensive for sure. Just didn't expect 6,000. Glad I saved my stuff. All right, Samurai Jack can only be accessed through the Battle Pass. Oh, and that's cool. Right next to every character, it'll tell you they're a little rank too. All right, time for the battle pass. You can start off with claiming, and you'll get Samurai Jack right off the bat. Let's look at some of the stuff, some of the free stuff. I'm gonna have to earn some more Gleamium before I can actually buy it, but I'll probably just. Wait, what is this? Oh, the voice pack. That's too cool. They got the original voice actor, too. <laughs> and new gems, of course. That's great. New gems to strive for. Cool Shazam skin. Some more Gleamium. Nice Scooby-Doo. <laughs> the dance. That's cool. I don't really like badges. You can only have so many badges, you know? More Steven Universe. They put some toast in there. Some detective bugs. Bugs has a lot of skins. Emote. Death. Ooh, that's kind of cool. What is that? That just looks cool. Gem XP too. They're they're gonna be filling it out with gem XP. Slowly, we're gonna see the season slowly fill out and have more filler. That's a cool uh, I guess that goes with the one that we got last season with Stripe. Look at that. <laughs> we can match now, Joe. Look at that. Ooh, what is this? A little Batarang emote? That's cool. I like that. As a Batman fan. Now that is cool. Scooby Snack Ring Out animation? Very cool. What is this? What is that? Adventure time? Jarring. That's kind of cool. This is Shazam. Is law. Emote. Jake skin. 
That's pretty cool. A little Houdini. I like that. Taz card. Normally, I don't like player cards in, in games, but they really know how to make a good player card in this game. Peanut butter jelly with a baseball bat. Oh my god, they added peanut butter jelly time for <laughs> banana guard. That's pretty cool. It's free also. Oh, wow. What? Oh, wait, no, I clicked on it. That's a very cool fin skin. Ooh, black suit Superman. It's about time. What? I don't. What is this? Oh, it's for Agent Smith. Okay. I forgot my picture up there is blocking it. Aku. Love it. All right. And the last skin is an Aku outfit for Jack. Very cool. And then I would say don't rush unless they change the odds because I got to rank 90 last season and only got free Gleam even once. It was such a slog. Hopefully they change those odds. Now this is just a first glance, but I like this battle pass much more than last battle pass, I think. I don't know if it's just the Samurai Jackness or maybe it's just they cater to more players that I like. Still no Batman items though. They never give anything free for Batman. Except for that Batarang emo. That's cool. But that's it. All right, as for events, we have ranked seasons. That's up there. Path of the Samurai. All right, Path of the Samurai. Collect objective stars from the experienced Path of the Samurai Rift to earn gem XP. For a toasty gem, interesting, okay. One medal, up to 4,000 battle pa pass XP, 1,000 fighter currency and more. Oh, it's tears, okay. All right, I'll have to dive into rifts in a minute. Another one of these, but here's these medals that they keep telling us about. I guess it's a new currency that we're going to be dealing with. Medals. Power to pledge. Make sure you edge your characters. Going to have to level up a bunch. And circuit drones coming in a week. Wait, hold on. I got to move my picture real quick. And whatever item that is. See, they're just adding more items and currencies now. It's going to start getting more fleshed out. Me and my friend Joe are currently playing the first Descendant. And it's a good game, don't get me wrong. But there's a lot of crafting and a lot of separate materials. And are we going to just start getting different currencies in this game? Because this game's not big enough for that stuff, in my opinion. But we'll see. We'll see what it is. Got these medals and these different pieces. We're going to find out. Right, the weekly stuff, the warm-up. Oh, wow, you got a lot of missions for that stuff. We got plenty to do, that's good. And then there's missions specifically for ranked. That's interesting. That'll be cool. Right, let's see what the free item is for the day. Battle pass, of course. Caveman Jack skin. That's what we should look at. We should look at the skins. Oh, I still got to wait for my freebie. Yeah, see, there's a whole nother shop. Now we got metal shop. Ooh, but you can trade a metal in for Gleamium. It's like tickets in Fallout 76. And we already own these characters, so... But see, if you look closer, only two of these skins can be purchased with the metals. And of course, it's the cheaper skins. The more expensive ones they want you to buy. That's a pretty cool Aria skin, though. I am glad you can trade them in for Gleamium, though. That's cool, though. I might get the Martian Golfer skin. But just another store with more currency. Let's see what we got in the prestige shop. And hopefully my prestige points did not reset. Okay, good. Good thing. All right, prestige shop. We got the mech suit Rick. The mech suit Morty. Wonder Woman 1984. That's funny. That's probably when that movie came out. But about Oh, okay, they stock. They don't go away. So we can still purchase the old prestige shop stuff. Troll dog. That's funny. Happy to know these skins are up for prestige points, though. That's really cool. Now let's check out the gem store now, or the rift shop. Oh, no, okay. We still keep the same gems, it looks like. But now they added a new one. Maybe we'll have a new gem per season. We have the discipline gem. Let's check out rifts, actually. Too many things to check out. I want to see the jack skins. Uh, only three. That's a shame. Righteous warrior. Let's check out rifts. All right. 
They're not going to show us the rest, but Second Rift opens up in about two weeks. And our first rift begins. Oh, it's just a new gem. Yeah, just new yellow gems. They probably just didn't want us acing like a purple real quick. Wait, and you can select. Wow, okay. So remember that when you do your daily gem XP, you can go back to season one and do them as well. That's good to know. That's also really good to know because some of the daily missions and stuff can be cheesed through rifts. So it's good that we can still keep some of those missions. Remember that tab. And I think that's about it. That would be what's new in Multiversus Season 2. Thank you guys for stopping by. A like is always appreciated. All the good YouTube stuff. And I will catch you out there in the multiverse. <laughs>